Hello, welcome to Trisha's Cards and Crafts and another one of my project reviews for Monday. Um, just going to go through the um, suite I'm going to be using for this week. I'm not quite sure which of them I'm going to use yet because I haven't actually decided that yet. But I will be using um, different items from all of this. Now what I, I've got, these are the um, Joy of Christmas suite. And all of these different things, it comes with all of these. Um, we've got these loose holly gems and sequins. Let me, whoops, there we go. There's lots and lots of different things in here. There, I think there's three different sizes of these little red gems. There. I don't know whether you can see these. And then you've got these holly leaves. You've got these notes. Um... So there's lots and lots of items in there. So we will probably try and use some of these up. I better make sure I don't want to lose any of them. Oops, <laughs> can't even pick them up. There we go. So I'll make sure those are sealed back in nice and tightly. Then we've got a Christmas Classics um, stamp set. Lots of nice greetings. You've got a nice um, set, a sprig of holly some holly berries, a little corner um, embellishment and some fur um, fronds, uh, <laughs> I'm not quite sure what you want to call it, some nice um, greetings and my nice sentiments and you've got the Christmas classic dies, um, I haven't opened these, let's just check, there's lots of nice things in here I'm sure, right so we have <coughs> You've got two sheets with different die, set, uh, die on. So you've got this square one with a nice square um, aperture to go so that it'll go in the middle. And that's got the little corners cut off. You've got some berries and the holly sprig that's in the stamp set. You've got some extra foliage as well on that one. And then you've got this one, which is a nice rectangular um die cut with a rectangular insert so that you can put comment comments and things your sentiments in there you've got two of these that will just cut out shapes um on into your card to give it more texture and then you've got these a big holly leaf and a the first sprig as well okay so those are the dies for the christmas classics and the and the christmas stamp set to go with that and then you've got the Joy of Noel dies and the Joy of Noel stamp set. On this one, you've got a Noel, which you can stamp. You've got some another cent, a couple of sentiments there and a to and a from. You've got two different sprays. I'm gonna, I will be definitely using this one. Um, then you've got a little, two little holly leaves and a little sprig of berries. And you've got some more, another uh, foliage bundle <laughs> um sprig of foliage there you've got some more that you can cut um stamp to give you more um <clears throat> sorry some more um texture on your cards as well you've got those two which could be used to go above the o for the noel if you are using it for um as a french word and um, we've got a nice little sprig there then the die set for this one it includes, once I've opened it, you will see. And this one has got the two different shapes that will um, cut out these two here. You've got another sprig of um, pine. You've got the Noel, which cuts out all the letters in one go. You've got one of the little holly sprigs. You've got some more. You've got the two O's for the Noel. Got no, two more holly leaves. So you've got three holly leaves all together. And you've got that sprig um, of these um, berries here. And you've also then got this, which will cut out some more foliage for you to use. If I can actually get it off. Here we go. So yeah, so you've got, that's either one, two, three, four, five different bits that will cut out some 
foliage that you can use for that as well. Okay, so that is the die set and the stamp set for the Joy of Noel. And then it comes with two different sets of papers. So you've got this set of papers, which is, whoops, let's see if I can just open this up first. Um, it's called the Joy of Christmas. And it's 12 by 12. They're both 12 by 12. And the colours for this one, Cherry Cobbler, Old Olive, Pecan Pie, Pebbled Path, Real Red and Shaded Spruce. So we've got these pieces of papers here. So you've got two of these with a wood grain on the back. You've got a check, a green check, or gingham, with a wood effect on the back, another one, a lighter one. And you've got a smaller pattern with the holly leaves and the sprigs of um, fir, fir bough, what, branch, <laughs> and berries. And you've got musical notes on the back of this one. And you've got one with leaves on. Not quite sure what leaves they are. With these, this red, I'm not quite sure, just pattern um, on the back. And then you've got the red gingham or check, and then you've got more music, musical notes on the back of this one. Some more manuscript. And then you've got these lovely red berries with a green background on this one. And those are those papers. So we've got some nice papers to work with. <coughs> At the moment, I think these are low in stock, but um, I'm not quite sure how long that will be for. And then you've also got these sets. And this is a speciality designer series paper. And it's called the Joyful Speciality Designer Series Paper. So Joyful 12 by 12. And these you get eight sheets and in cherry cobbler and shaded spruce. So we've got whoops this sheet, two of those, and they're only ones they're single-sided as well. And you've got this gold wood grain effect. Two sheets of that. Two sheets of the red with musical notes on with the notation on. And then you've got two sheets of the white with the gold leaves and the red berries on. But it's the gold that's the um, foiled. The red berries aren't on this one. Okay. Right, so those are your papers that come with the set. So, here we go. So we've got two sets of papers to work with. We've got two stamp sets and two die sets. And we've also got a set of um, items we can use for embellishments. So the loose holly gems and sequins. Okay, so... Hopefully you'll join me for my projects that I'll be making during the week and <clears throat> I'll see you then. Thanks for joining me now. Bye bye.